Hi everyone, it's Alexis and I'm back again with another Tuesday morning haul. I, um, for our little honeymoon weekend, we went out shopping and I went to Tuesday morning. Um, so the first Tuesday morning I went to is the same one that I went to last time. So I didn't really have that many new things, but I did go to a second one. But at the first one I found <clears throat> these little birdie, um, glitter poinsettia, uh, stickers, and I mostly bought, oops, not that one, I mostly bought the gold ones, but I did buy some silver and a lot, because I have a lot of plans with them, and they don't come with that many big ones in there, so I bought most of the gold ones, and they were $3.49 each, unfortunately, and... Then I bought these to go with them for, because, like I said, when I go to Tuesday morning, I'm usually buying shabby chic stuff for those types of card making things. So, mostly flowers is what I get. And then a bunch of other cool stuff. I got more of that glitter paste. I know you guys have seen it if you watched my last video, but I'm thinking of showing it for, like, the people that didn't watch my last video. So, I just got more of the silver because silver is a color that I, uh use more often than like the other colors so this was $2.99 and it's Bow Bunny and let's see um I got some Bow Bunny laser cut chipboard pieces and they are beautiful butterflies and they were $1.99 each here's like you kind of see that top one a little better in this pack so I thought those would be fun to like color and everything and use on multimedia projects. And I didn't see this last time. It is uh, Sheena Douglas um, Alchemy. Is that how you say it? say it? Yeah, I think that's how you say it. Anyways, and it's three metal dies. So these are the dies you get. You get like the little cupboard thing and then um, the beakers. They didn't have the stamp set that coordinates with it, so I think I'm going to have to, like, look for that. The other place didn't have it either, but here's the dies. And that was $4.99. And just like last time, I bought a bunch of these gems. Because I use these, I use pearls, gems, and sequins on my projects a lot. And I really liked the fact that they had a bunch of colors for, like... It fit any project, especially for Christmas, those would be good. So, yeah, I pretty much bought out the joint again. But I go through them like crazy, so money well spent in my book. And also the spread line tape again. I go through this like crazy. I love how strong this is. This is very strong tape. If you're needing something stronger for a project that's like... Uh, functional like you open it up or something like that I would definitely recommend something like red line tape so then um spellbinders had to have and to hold dies and so I just got married and I'm gonna be doing a <clears throat> wedding scrapbook so I figured this was perfect and they are actually quite large which is what I wanted I did open it up before I bought it because I wanted to see how small it was but yeah so this is like the perfect size for um, scrapbooks. And then I can use this and sign for anything. And so that was $4.49. And then the last thing I got at that tw Tuesday morning was this little birdie joyful, uh, what is that, Rhapsody? Is that what it is? Rhapsody? I don't know. I don't keep up. Anyways, $3.49. And you get, the thing I really liked was these um, cut apart Santas and it kind of reminded me of Graphic 45. And then that page, which I'll probably just cut up and I could use the deer or just that corner or whatever I want to do. And then um, you get that and I really like those poinsettias. And then you can have like cut apart words to put on your uh, project and then you get some glitter paper. And this is like a damask, I think that's what you call it, pattern. 
So I was really happy to find this. Uh, you only get seven printed and then three glitter papers, but I mean, for that price and I liked the designs, it was worth it. Okay, so at the next Tuesday morning, I found my absolute favorite things that I got the entire day, which was Harry Potter dice. Um, I actually had some of these already in my watch cart thing on eBay. So the fact that I got them at Tuesday morning instead was pretty amazing. I could not believe it when I saw them. So I got Dumbledore and it comes with um, the face stamp. And so that was $6.99. And then um, Voldemort and then the little snake tattoo thing with Bob was all uh, $5.99. Huh, why is Voldemort less? I guess because he's evil. <laughs> um, so you get like the face stamp that goes on there. And then, um, and so this one, Hermione was $6.49. That's weird that they're all different prices. Um, I still need to get Harry and Ron, and then I already have one of them that I did order on eBay. It was like the sorting hat and, um, nine and three quarters since all that but i was super excited because i love harry potter and i plan to do some um multimedia cards okay so i got some wood <laughs> but i figured because these were, um, what are they called? I don't know. I saw a natural birch ornament. So I figured these would be fun to stamp on and then color or do whatever I want with them. And then I could take screws and screw down the top and then, um, make it like an ornament. So that's what I got these for. I figured these would be fun, um, to do as like gifts or something. So I got all that they had, which was only two packs and it was $4.99. And this one didn't have a price, so I just told her to ring it up as $4.99. She got a little sassy, but I was like, whatever, just get me checked out and let's go. So $4.99 for each bag of these. And then I thought this would be fun to do like the same type of idea, but for like decoration for my house. And this was $1.99. So this is, um, it kind of coordinates with that other set that I got and it uses the same stamp set that I need to order. Um, but here's like the little candle Thing that you heat up burners and stuff with and it was $4.99. I didn't actually do any Halloween cards this year. I'm on like a Christmas kit. So I got these flowers um, by Little Birdie and they were $2.99. And like I said, same thing, multimedia, shabby chic projects, whichever one you want to call it. But I thought they were really cool because they were colored but then had like that crackled look in them. And so then here's like the cream one. And I know I got several packs of those. Oh, there's more red line tape. So, some more flowers. They only had one pack of each of these. And it was like navy and purple um, glittery flowers. I think you can see the glitter. And it was $2.49. And then here's some cream colored ones. That store also had a pack of these, so I went ahead and grabbed them because you only get six pieces per pack. And then Little Birdie had these chipboard pieces. They only had one pack like these. They had some other ones like of Christmas trees and stuff like that, but I just really wanted the ornaments and it was $1.99. Now this is how lazy I am. 
So I've been wanting some paper tags for doing some homemade Christmas tags, but I'm, I have a tag punch and I'm too lazy to use it because you have to cut the pieces like two inches and then stick it in. I'm just lazy. So I bought some tags and even though they're gray on the front, I'll figure I'll just use the back. Yeah. So welcome to my lazy world. So they were one nineteen, but I figured, you know, for a dollar and 19 cents, why not save me some time? I got these jumbo paper clips, and quite frankly, I'm not sure why. I think I had a reason, but it is escaping me. Anyways, I now ha am the proud owner of some giant paper clips for a dollar seventy nine. Yeah, sounds good. Oh yeah, this is another one that I got another one of of that bow bunny um, paste. It's like a sparkle one. It's called sugar. And this is another one that I go through, like, silver, like, just neutral colors that I go through. Um, so I got those. They had some more of the other colors, but I didn't need more of those. And I got some envelopes for $1.49 just because I'm running out. I'm not sure if this was actually a good deal, but they were right there. And, um... I got this burlap doilies from Little Birdie for $1.49. Um, it doesn't actually say how many you get. I don't know, but I bought them. And, oh, I think that's it. The only other thing is just more of these flowers. So yeah, it was just a small little haul. Oh wait, no, hold on. Forgot. I did get one paper pad there. Oh geez, this one has three. I didn't get very much paper this time. I'm very picky with my paper. Last time they just had like a lot of stuff that I wanted, but this time they didn't have as much that I wanted. Um, so this was $6.99, and it is My Mind's Eye Happy Haunting uh, Designer Series Paper, or Designer Paper Pad. I'm just used to Designer Series from Stampin' Up. Anywho, so you get some cut-apart uh, letters, so you ha it spells out spooky, scary, but you can just cut that out and use the letters as you want them. Then you get some glittery skulls almost like damask type look and whatever that is <laughs> and those would be cool to cut out so i figured this would be fun for halloween cards next year i just am not in a halloween mood this year for some reason Normally I decorate and everything. I put up a few decorations, but I'm just in the mood. I'm on a Christmas mood. <laughs> what is that supposed to be? Is that a bat? Oh, now I see it. I was looking at this part. I wasn't looking at the black part. <laughs> and then some polka dots, chevron, whatever that is. Some cut aparts, or you can just use it that if you want to. This is just black. <laughs> um, interesting. Um, so yeah, that is that paper pad. Okay, now I am officially done. It was a very small haul this time, but that's okay. So I will see you next time.